Hi, YouTube. How are you doing? And welcome back to Dave the Diver. You are in for a treat today because we are going to go crazy in this game. The first thing we're going to do is we are going to have probably the best night in the sushi restaurant ever because it is both a tuna festival. There's also a VIP and we have prepared like crazy in the last two episodes to make this night the best night that we've ever had. So I wonder how much money we're going to make. And besides that, we're also going to do all kinds of other stuff. There's a lot of things happening all at once. If you've seen this game before, you know it's absolutely crazy. And it does basically every genre under the sun. And it's going to be fun today. I hope you enjoy. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. And let's hop into the game. Let's go. There we go. Wait, what? I don't know what's going on here because there's supposed to be a ship back there. You can still see... It is the event, but I guess the ship was only if you if you saw the end of the last episode, there was like a ship here with like a light show going on. But I guess they're already in the restaurant waiting for us to sell them a bunch of fish. Now, also, I think the farm has just finished so we can get our rice from here as well. I need to be careful here because I if we mess up with our menuing here, we might be losing out on a lot of money. So we should be. We should set up the menu very carefully because we're going to be selling a whole lot of stuff today, making a ton of money. Uh, haven't played a game like this in a while. Didn't know I was going to play a game like this. Honestly, I expected... Uh, there you go. I expected Dave the Diver to just be like a very short game and we just have some fun with it. But I've been engrossed ever since I started because it is... It's a wild ride and you got to see it to the end. Uh, it's... It's like one of the most unique games I've ever played because it's doing so many things at once. Here we go. Hey, are you ready? It's party time. It's Sammy from uh, Hot Pepper Tuna. Right on time. Have a seat. It won't take long. Oh, boy. It's going crazy. The VIP. Dish. I'll deliver it. Oh, there's the boat. The boat's back. Look at that. Music. So jazzy. Vegetable sushi. Oh no. No, oh, I have to mute it. Don't don't do hop hop tuna. Yeah, hop tuna. I'm sorry if I have to mute some of this because I know it's copyrighted, but what the hell is going? <laughs> Oh no, that was short enough, you probably could hear it. What the fuck? Yes, this is it. What the actual hell? The taste of this vegetable sushi reminds me of my younger day. Your younger days. Your vegetable sushi is perfect. What's the secret? All I did is seasoning properly. I also got some help from my acquaintances for the ingredients. Oh, there he is. You want? Son? <laughs> of course, dude. Dad? <laughs> I wondered who'd eat something like vegetable sushi. I didn't know it was you. I heard people talking about someone who looks like you. That's why I visited here and ordered vegetable sushi. It has been eight years since you left home. You never contacted us ever since. Well, it's a long story. There was a storm and I got shipwrecked on an uninhabited island. There was just trees in the sea. I worked hard to get food and water and sometimes hunted w wild animals with a harpoon gun and roasted them. I had to spend some years on the islands until I got rescued and settled here. What a story, Dad. I wanted to visit home after securing a stable life here, but it took so long and time flew. I am sorry, my boy. The folks at the village think you abandoned us, Dad. My friends pitied me and some mocked me. I began writing music and singing songs to relieve stress and I became a rapper. My son has grown into such a fine young man, even without me. I am proud of you, son. I blamed you so much at first, but the music healed me, gave me inner peace. Since you've come all the way here, why don't you stay at my farm? Of course, like old times. Aha, since you've all grown up, we can share some beer together. Dude, how wholesome. What an evening. <clears throat> mm. What a plot twist, the rapper was the son of Otto. They have something in common. Both are quite talkative. Yeah, I agree. This is a good thing. Bancho Sushi helped them reunite. The two must have much to say. I hope they can resolve their misunderstandings. A thousand gold and we get we get a vinyl record. Alrighty. The Hot Pepper Tuna song is so good. By the way, you should look it up. It's just saying Hot Pepper Tuna over and over again, but it's ridiculous. Uh, okay. 
Here we go. Let's see. I am going to also save the game just in case. Save the game because we are going on uh, a crazy ride here. And then let's see. We got a little bit of cash. We should maybe upgrade this guy. Yes, training. So he has this 10% chance of increasing the number of plates. So basically 10% more money, <laughs> which is kind of wild. <clears throat> Good stuff. Ingredient prep master. Our whole team is decked out. Look at this. Look at this squad, man. It's crazy. We're also still trying to find people. Why are you so expensive? Oh, you can apparently see details. Yeah, you can see their max stats. Oh my god. Oh, you can see even their skills. Oh, <laughs> I didn't know that. Must leave reach level 20 to have these stats. Okay, wait, that's actually really useful. I didn't know that you, you could even see their special skills. Okay. Uh, cleaning, serving plus, serving ability increases permanently. Okay, so some of these are like crazy because this guy was like, how much? This guy is like a thousand. If you max him out, that's kind of crazy. What do you do? You are procuring of, wait a minute. Acquire more ingredients through dispatch. 5% chance of, incre of increasing the plates. That's not too great, but you're actually what I'm looking for here. Because I'm looking for a procure master. So I guess I'm going to hire you then. And just send you off. Hire. And then... I should be training him as well. But I'll send you to... Get what now? Number owned. Dude, I got 17. I should get some uh, other stuff, huh? Got lots of olive oil. Lots of everything. Let's just get some sesame seeds. One to two. That's not very good, but whatever. Dispatch. Masayoshi. Okay, they're all they're all gonna get some more food for me. Now, let's see. How are we doing? We need to research. Do we research these? I don't think we want to put these on our menu today because they're maybe. I think they're mostly gonna be focused on doing the tunas, right? So let's just do the tunas. Oh my god, look at all these upgrades. We got this right here. That is kind of crazy. I don't want to upgrade that because then I can't sell it anymore. So we're going to put that on the menu. It's six per... Oh my god. Okay. Uh, this is kind of wild. We got vegetable sushi too. 375? Goodness gracious. Uh, what the hell? Let's put this on here. Put it on there once and then we're going to auto supply. Uh, put this. We should upgrade these, right? Is there any like multi-dish we have? We have this thing. Which is like the tropical fish sushi set. That is very expensive. This takes rice. This takes rice. This is six rice. This is three rice per piece. I think this is very good if we can sell a lot of this. But I think we save that for another night. And now we just put on all the tuna. Because we've we've gotten all this shit for, for a reason. Oh god, we get another cutscene. What are you doing, sir? I can't believe how much detail they put in this game. Oh, he's gonna destroy the whole place. This guy is a magic man. There's customers! What are you doing, sir? People are just gonna be terrified. Beautiful. Thank you very much. Boncho man. I like how they're giving all the characters a backstory as well. Okay, so 100, 175. Uh, could we do again? I think we do one more. Because we're not going to be able to sell the whole batch anyway. And then we upgrade you. I think we upgrade you twice as well. And we have you. We're going to upgrade you actually three times. Actually four times, I think. We can sell ten of this. <clears throat> and we got this as well. Wait, are these the same ingredients? No, these are different ingredients. Holy shit. This is crazy. Okay, so then we put this on here. Wait a minute. What is what sushi does this? I need to check the details. Um, You are yellowfin tuna. Yellowfin tuna. We can only... So we need to... Not put too much yellowfin tuna on the menu. Okay, so... Oh, no. We can only make a 
few more. I should leave this. I should leave the yellowfin tuna for the other thing. I shouldn't have upgraded so much. That's my bad. Um, okay, so we're gonna throw this up. Wait, this is level five? When that happen? I, I mean, I just did that, but when that happened? Someone explain this to me. Uh, then we put this on here. That's yellowfin. Oh, it's just... Wait, oh, it's different. Wait, what? This is yellowfin tuna what now? Can I see what it is? I guess I'll just... Wait, what is it? It's Akami. Yellowfin tuna Akami. Okay, yellowfin tuna Akami. What is this then? Oh, these are different. Okay, wait, they're different ingredients. Oh, nice. Okay. And we'll just throw that on there. I actually don't like tuna, by the way. I, I, I think tuna kind of tastes like nothing. It just tastes like... Maybe I just haven't had good seasoning on my tuna, but it, it it's like one of the least tasteful fish in my opinion. Um, but that's just because I'm probably fucked up or something and I'm going to get people mad at me. Uh, we should upgrade these as well. I think we're just going to go full tuna. That's why, we, that's why we're here, right? Boom. And now we auto supply. Oh, we can even add more. Are you fucking nuts dude there's so much no that's the akami that's the akami that we shouldn't use up that's the one for the special dish so i'm just gonna leave that there and then we'll throw this on there this also uses rice though i don't want to use the rice this uses salt let's throw this on here and then like auto supply everything oh boy <laughs> auto supply this is going to be a good day, huh? If we don't have like a single dish that's going to carry us here. It's just going to be if there's a large quantity of customers, we're going to make money. But if there's not, then we're not really going to make too much money. This, there's We have better dishes that we're going to sell on the next day. All right, here we go. Let me do one more double check. Everything is auto supplied. Everything looks good. I think this is the right setup. Let's go. Oh, boy. Am I gonna order? They're all happy. They're all rich motherfuckers. Yo, yo, they get a, they get a bonus if they order tuna. Wait a minute. Got you. I wish I had someone who could serve drinks. That would definitely be useful here. But I need to do wasabi as well. Oh, you want a star? What is going on? I gotta do wasabi. I gotta do wasabi. This is impossible. This is. The, I definitely need someone who does drinks. I gotta do you. Uh, oh god, I did way too much. I did way too much. Go, oh, just get one of them. Stop complaining so much. The stress of retail or the stress of customer service is real, man. Okay. I wish I had more wasabi. Yeah, the other guy can clean, right? Yeah, he can. Dude, we got 9,000 already and we still got some time left. Come on, beat our record. Do it! Oh, baby. We're doing it. There's still more people. Come on. That's gonna be bad. Yeah. We're... Should let go earlier. You're getting less beer. Please don't. Oh, I just did it <laughs> barely in time. I love how they're all waiting for me. 13,000! And that was just selling, like, regular regular sushi there so that was real good we didn't even use like our op stuff which means that the next day we could also oh this was still our best thing oh just because it is the most expensive there you go a new record twelve thousand as our record damn dude and yeah these are our most selling dishes but that's just because they're boss dishes the boss dishes are super expensive like they sell crazy they alone can carry like half your night in terms of profits. Here we go. It is actually like, I mean, I guess it never gets winter here. Oh, it's McSammy or MC Sammy. Uh, hello, Dave. Have a good night. I, I want to see this post. Have a good night's sleep. Yes. Did you spend enough time talking with Sammy yesterday? Of course. We had not seen each other for so long before yesterday. So we definitely had a good time. By the way, I want to show you something. Come to the farm if you have time. Oh, God. I wanted to read the post. I'm going to forget now. But sure. You can raise up to five chickens per breed? What? <laughs> Did you see that tooltip? We got chickens now? 
It never ends. It never ends, dude. Huh? Chickens? And, um, Sammy, what happened to your clothes? Uh, hey, yo, I talked to my pops yesterday and got all sentimental. You know what I'm saying? I became a rapper because I love music, but I got tired of that celeb life. I think we could use them to cook with. I'll give them to you when you get here. Take them to cook. So you got... So you quit music? No, no. I will stay here to enjoy my rural life and nature while writing new songs. Yeah. You know I can release new songs at any time online these days. It's so easy to do that. Aha, by the way, what's up with that chicken? Hey, I shared some food with the neighbors and they gave me this chicken in return. I wanted to make a yummy fried chicken, but my son wanted it to let it lay eggs. And he made a chicken farm overnight. He reminds me of my younger self. Haha, <laughs> and I got inspiration from the rhythm of the hammer, you know? It warms my heart to see you and your son together. Speaking of the chicken, from now on, I will offer you eggs at my farms. Oh, eggs, you say? I can't give you more than one egg because there's only one chicken. If you want more chickens, ask Sammy. Remember, only one chicken per, ch per or one egg per chicken per day, no more. There are two grades for eggs, A and B. Good grade chickens lay good grade yeah. eggs. I will stay here with my pops. Come visit me often, yo. Eggs, huh? Boncho's menu will be expanding for sure. This is insane. You can now raise chickens. You can acquire eggs in the morning. Try developing new recipe. <laughs> this shit is fucking wild, man. Oh boy. And we got more for vegetable sushi, so we can make more of that. Goodness gracious. I need to pay attention to which fish I... Like, now it's getting overwhelming to the point where I should manage better which fish I actually want. Okay. What do you... I need to... buy seeds. Grow fertili fertilizer. Can we expand the field? Yes. Okay. I think we do that. It's not that expensive. We upgrade it once. By tomorrow. And then we will do... I think I kind of want to do the same thing again because we know this works. And then nutrient fertilizer that enriches soil lasts a day. I guess it goes faster. I don't want to do that. We could expand it more, but I don't think I want to. Oh, you can just buy these? Oh, wow. You can buy the seeds or you can just buy them already grown. I definitely grade A egg. 450 holy shit all right sir and buy a chicken free range chicken there's a high chance of laying great a eggs 70 percent there's some chance chicken that lays normal eggs oh i see Wait, what you have, don't have these you don't have them in, oh in stock we have this one okay so we could buy this guy for 20 or for 2,000 to get grade A eggs. But it's only, it's 70%. That's quite often. And it's like not even that much less. Like you lay an egg a day, right? So we get an egg every day, which is kind of nice. Getting... I'm spending all my money, by the way. <laughs> what the fuck? I'm going to get a free range chicken. Rename gonna be eco i don't know it's gonna be loco the chicken loco in all caps loco the chicken he is so he's loco <laughs> okay and do we do more i don't i don't i don't know if i add more chickens i think just having one egg per day and then one rare egg per day man there's so many things you can like <laughs> keep like scaling up man i should invest my money though because like what else am i gonna invest it on we already got the rice farm going that's like maxed out we got this you know what maybe we'll add maybe we'll add another one of these uh whoopsie daisy i accidentally stopped the recording i don't know what happened but i luckily caught it really fast all i did that you missed is i bought many chickens maybe too many chickens uh we got little from chicken little we got Loco, and we have two unnamed chickens that you guys have to name in the comments down below. Uh, let me know which names I should pick, and you're already working on the next piece of farm. So yeah, we base. Oh, and Big Chick. We got Big Chick as well. <laughs> so yeah, basically, I wasted, or wasted, I spend all my money on chickens that may lay eggs or not, but 
Imagine if they do. We got a 70% chance per chicken to lay super eggs, basically. Which I don't even know if this was worth it. I might may have just it may have been better to only get one and then wait a day and see if they're even worth it. But you know what? I'm going crazy. Anyway, luckily you didn't miss too much. And luckily I saw it fast because that could have been real bad. That's the downside of uh, off stream recording. If something goes wrong or like the recording gets corrupted. I've made videos before like on Phasmo where I did a whole recording and then afterwards the, the audio got corrupted. So I had to throw it all in the in the dumpster. Anyway, okay, so our tuna day is over. We also did the VIP. We're now back to chill action. Um, I got a... What is this? Steel sensor. Yeah, I want this. Steel net trap. Good stuff. Uh, nice. So we're gonna go get some tuna with that. And then we should go to the... We should go along and down to the sea people as well. Because, uh... Oh, we need to go to where the ship sank? Wait. I, I just saw the mission there. Also, what are you? A pelican eel? You look like a like a frog uh, before it becomes a frog. I forgot what they're called in English. Oh boy. Okay, I move aside. There we go. We have two of these. Where are the tuna at? Are they still going to be here or tuna? Maybe tuna are actually super rare. And I just got many of them because of the special event. That might be it. Just back here, we're tuna before. Oh God, not you, not you. Wait a minute, wait a minute. What if I catch you with this? <gasps> it doesn't even work on this guy. I hate it here. You are a piece of shit. Is that because he was attacking? <laughs> okay, do not try this at home, kids. Do not interact with that shark. That shark in particular, I mean, I killed one in the last episode, but it was a fucking battle. seem like there are any tuna around i guess it's similar that is the one thing i understand why they do it like i understand why they need to give you tuna but it's a bit of a shame that usually like that once those events are over you can't get those rare fish anymore so it feels like you kind of you just got handed a ton of money and then they like don't give you the event uh, they, they don't give you the fish anymore But it's fine. It's fine. We made a lot. We made our our best night yet. Twelve thousand. Also another big shark. Don't care about you. Uh, oh God! Don't you dare! I would like this. And with all our, there's just so much you could spend your money on because we could upgrade our employees to get better at getting re resources, which I think might be worth. Like if we can get one guy to just bring back, like I don't know. 15 of a resource every <laughs> like um every day that would be crazy we could get so many special dishes wait are these new fish these look very i'm gonna destroy them with the harpoon they're so tiny what are you guys wait i can't even hit them man wait oh there we go i thought i couldn't hit them blue head tile fit i've got that before apparently I need to look at my recipes, what I'm actually looking for, because right now I am, I am, I do not know what I should get, like what, what good recipes. I know you guys make a good recipe. Also, I'm going to get a little bit of you. Just because I can. And we're kind of just like shooting in the dark here anyway. I knew, know you're good. Me. Uh, I'm stuck. What? Why did it just freeze me? Just to do the cutscene, I guess. <laughs> no! It was meant to hit. Boop. Just trying to get some new fish here. Because usually I just go down and get all the deep sea fish. But if we want to make some special dishes, we got to branch out a little. Because we are getting so many resources. Because that's where the real money lies, right? I, like, most of my money has come from me just selling, oh god, um, like, a fish as its separate sushi, which is kind of how, like, also quite a bit of sushi works, honestly. Um, although I'm not the sushi expert, I just order it 
quite often because it's delicious. <laughs> gonna give me UV light. It always does. Can I catch you? Let's see it. Hello, sir. Come over. Are you too big to be caught? Oh, let's go. Nice. Oh, we could have upgraded that as well. That might have been a good investment. Although I think the fishing part of the game is actually not where I should invest my money. Because I already... Like, I'm doing pretty well when it comes to the fishing part of the game. It's mostly the, the rest that I need to upgrade. Just like getting... In order to make the better dishes, you gotta have the special food. I, I mean, this is just a, an easy way to make a lot of money. Because this is like... This has been my go-to dish to sell. I think I upgraded it to like level 6 or something crazy. Hi there, you're still evil. I don't want to deal with you. Wait, could I kill you with this? Could I bop your head? <laughs> I did a lot of that. Wait, it, did, it died. Blue spotted stargazer. Look at that. Nice. Gonna be more jellies up here. I'm going too far up. I'm even out of the area. I think I still want more of these guys down here. Only at 60? Man. Turns out upgrading your uh, inventory was actually a bad idea because now you f you have to stay down here for fucking 30 minutes at a time to get all the fish. Uh, suffering from success over here. We can go in this. Yes. I think because of these things, the... Like, because of these, like, passageways, the deep sea feels so similar everywhere. Like, they really... Because with the upper areas, I never feel like I'm going in the same areas over and over again. Like, every time I visit the deep sea. So, you need to have more variety down here. Nice. We're getting... Oh, they're so heavy, dude. There's seven to pop. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Didn't even realize that. Also, you are there. Oh, and there's the blood guys, but I need more bullets. There's bullets right there, dude. This is insane. I love jellyfish because they're like the ultimate tranquilizer fish. And I am like tranquilizer is the main way we're, we're fishing right now. Um... No, 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 no! Don't explode, don't explode. Fuck you, idiot. <laughs> Why are you so silly? Uh, I was talking last episode, which has only been like two hours ago for me, about all the games that are coming out. And there is a lot. Like, I'm... Tonight, I'm excited for... Uh, the complex, the new, the new complex, like the new Backrooms game that's coming out. But then there's also, as I said, Nicolas Cage DLC for, uh, Dead by Daylight. There's the DLC for FNAF 6. There is, uh, Observation Duty 6, which is coming out, which is very exciting. That's gonna be cool. There's Silent Hill 2, which I haven't really looked in at all. I don't know when exactly that is, but, uh... I'll play that. I've never played a Silent Hill game. I've, I have barely played any of the Resident Evils. That should be something for next, like, Nostalgia Month. Where we focus a lot on, like, those kind of classics. Because I, I just haven't played much of them. But I'm just going to leave here. I have a ton of jellyfish. <laughs> Maybe too much, one might say. And wait, now we're going to be able to farm those. Because when we did our last jellyfish hunt... We didn't have that part of the farm available, but now we're going to be able to grow a bunch of jellies. I guess the farm is meant for you to, like, focus on one fish, and then after you have all the eggs, you don't even have to fo you don't have to get have to get those fish anymore because um, you're just, like, farming them in your in your fish farm. Like, look at this. We got a bunch of comb, comb jellyfish. 
Um, we should check the farm, though, obviously, because that... Wait, I could check if there's weeds, so I don't have to run over there. There's a weed! We will not have weeds. Not in our farm. And is he already gonna be... Did he make it, or is it gonna take a day? Like, Stardew Valley style. <laughs> Oh, it's still 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 busy. How can I? Oh, I can increase the nutrients by buying from him. Hmm, maybe I should. Maybe I should. Oh no, I died. Peace. Fuck me, man. What is that? That's uh, eggplant that died. Rip. That's okay, though. It's, it's gonna happen. Okay, can I just drop this in the water? Oh, here. Boom. Now it's gonna increase, and then can I drop it in this area? Okay, now that's gonna increase, because it's just going down over time. Look at all our chickens. Look at all those chickens. I'm just, I'm just looking to the side, making sure I was still recording. I'm scared now. Okay, good stuff. I don't... I, I wish they would at least give you like a, like if you, I wish you only had to check the farm once a day instead of like every time you fish, like three times a day. Okay, so one more, we have afternoon, which I guess we're just going down there, maybe grabbing, oh, it's already, oh, you only sell one item per day? Um, I'll take that, why not? Go in. And just take whatever we can get. We should also fish, visit the fish farm because they are probably very, very full <laughs> at this point. Blobfish. Hey, look, this is a blobfish. This is what I was talking about. Where uh, some fish live down like in the deep sea and they can never leave their home. Because if they like, not just like they can't leave the sea, obviously, because they're fish. But if they were go would go up or down too much, the pressure would change to the point where they would just die. Which is kind of interesting because you would expect, I guess, like you would expect fish to mostly live where there is like solid ground, right? Because what's a fish gonna do in like open waters? Like barely anything, right? I'm assuming most fish live like along the bottom of the ocean. So like they start at the beach and then like it goes down and and that, like, the large open areas are just very bare. But I might be wrong. Oh, I should have not done that yet and should have used some ammo and then upgraded it. Which replenishes your ammo. That's that's a little bit of Dave the Diver optimization for you right there. Feel free to use it. You got stare. Wait, we got something. Poison sack? I don't think we should use that. That seems like a dangerous thing. I don't think I'd ever eat, like, those super, like, lethal sushis. Well, they're not lethal sushi, but they're made... If they're poorly made, they would just kill you. I would never eat those, like, voluntarily. That sounds absolutely ridiculously stupid. Okay, you're just a big shark. I don't care about you. I kind of want to want these guys. Can I tranquilize them? No. Oh. Wait, what? How did they miss? There's like a whole group of them. Oh, I hit so many. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't know if this is good. I, I don't even know if these are like useful at all, but I just want them because I don't know. They look funny. I'm gonna fall asleep. Ah. No, they're gonna kill me. Fuck. Ow, 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 ow. Can I hit them multiple at the same time? Nope, I can't. Oh god, I'm gonna die to these fucking tiny fishes! Leave me alone! No! I'm actually gonna die. I'm gonna die. I can't, I can't leave. I can't leave. I can't leave. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying to the tiny fish. I have died to tiny fish. I have died to the tiny fish. <laughs> I have died to the tiny fish. <laughs> uh, all right i'm gonna take the fucking starry puffer poison sack i guess fucking striped catfish dude there's just too many there's too many of them 
god. <laughs> well, at least we get to do another evening now. Which means we get to do another huge money haul. <laughs> Why did I do that? Should've, I should, I didn't realize they would be so ferocious, man. Because they were chilling just a moment ago. But then all of a sudden, they just wouldn't let up. They would just like... They would just keep attacking me forever. There we go. Six salt, a bunch of stuff. We need to upgrade you guys. Uh, let's go to the fish farm because this must be completely full. Also, question mark? There's some, there's a quest over in the, in the sushi restaurant. There's going to be a new VIP probably because there's usually a VIP. Okay, we need to empty this farm because it is overcrowded as shit. It is... How fast are these fish multiplying, dude? This is ridiculous. I don't even know if I need those titan fish, but if we ever find a dish that uses it, we're gonna be rich. Yeah, I'm just, I'm gonna leave up to four of each. Oh, the tuna here. That is actually huge. If we can get the yellowfin tuna to, to multiply, we can make the tuna dish, the like $200 dish. That's crazy. Constantly. Oh boy. I need to increase density maybe. I think I can do that. Like I can upgrade my density. Because there is not enough space in this. Not enough ta not enough space in this town for the both of us. Um. And these, these are good. This is such an annoying system, by the way, the way they've done this, like where they've, I, I guess they have to separate out the two stars and the three stars, but wish it didn't work this way because it's annoying. Oh, lots of jellies. Because they also hatched. And seven clown, come on, man. Oh. Oh boy, yeah, there's some more of these as well. It's fine, it's fine. We're, we're, we'll get rich slowly. I mean, and we can also just always sell these guys. There's only 28%. I'll leave them just multiplying. And these, there's a lot of these tiny ones. A lot of white shrimps. Too many, one might say. Oh. Alright, get out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. It's sushi time. Sushi time. And there's going to be a quest going on or something happening here. I don't know what. There. Oh, you're back. But you got a new friend, though. <laughs> the IB appeared. Wang Pang, the master chef. Hello, everyone. This is Yui from NDC Station. Today, I present a new program called Challenge the Chef, featuring Vincent Yamaoka. It's been a long time, everyone. I am Vincent Yamaoka. The champion of the last season was Bonsho, who was praised by Vincent. He will be defending the- he will be the defending champion today. The defending champion? And this season's first challenger is Wang Pang. It's my honor to be here. I am Wang Pang from Hong Kong. Nice to meet you, Wang Pang. All right, we've met- the contestants now let's begin the show you two will compete with dishes on the same day at the same place on a given theme vincent yamaoka will judge your dishes today's theme for the contest is chinese cuisine oh well this isn't good as you know chinese cuisine developed many different why are we why do we we are not participating in a chinese cuisine fucking battle we are a sushi restaurant you good sir this is a wendy's <laughs> Why are you coming to us? We didn't even sign up for this shit and we don't even have Chinese cuisine. When we talk about Chinese cuisine, many will think of stir-fried meat and vegetables, but that's not all. There is more than that. This time you two compete for a dish using fish. Okay, here we go. At least they got, gave us that. Give me a Chinese style fish dish. May the best chef win. I heard of you and your reputation, Bonsha. I will beat you with your fabulous recipe from Hong Kong. Of course you're gonna beat us. We have never made this. We are gonna be... If, if you lose to us, you should fucking quit being a chef and fucking, like, retire. Because you'd be an absolute failure. Oh, Wang Pang just issued an official challenge. This should be interesting. 
You know the rules, folks. We will come back in two days to broadcast the intense competition between the two contestants in real time. Stay tuned and see what transpires in today's Challenge the Chef. I love how you talk in emojis. That's that's very that's very lovely. <laughs> this fucking guy is doing his uh, you couldn't see it, but he's doing some kind of dance. Are you okay? You're not familiar with Chinese cuisine, are you? I don't need to be Chinese to compete with him. I will use a Chinese culinary style, but with a type of fish they have never tasted before. Let's not go overboard, Bancho. I can't teach him a lesson with ordinary fish. If you say so, bring me the ingredients I want in two days. Chinese cuisine is no problem. I will just need stargazers. We got that. Wheat. Oh, stargazers are hard to get, though. Stargazers, wheat, olive oil, and eggs. Okay, we got olive oil. We are gonna get eggs because we got lots of chickens. Stargazers, and then we need wheat from the farm. So we're gonna put that on our next row of farm. Uh, oh my god, we got. So we need to get a better dish. How do you get better dish? Um, good upgrade these guys. I think it's time. It's time to just. Oh, I am. I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm sorry. Um. And then we get this one as well. Oh, and that's it. Hey, what? What is this thing? Seahorse? Slightly fried seahorse? <laughs> that's so weird. Um, roasted big eye scad? Small spotted boiled with kajime or whatever. That's also good. What are these? Wait, we got so much of this. Well, not the soy sauce. Small spotted dark. We don't have that at all. Big eyes scad. Okay. I should just keep getting keep getting stuff. That's always good. Uh, did I dispatch them again? By the way, I did not send them dispatching. I'm stupid. I made a grave mistake. You guys are all useless. You're pretty damn good though. I could get you as like our. I feel like we're already doing fine. Like I feel like maybe it's the game is not very clear in when you are like. Um, should I even get more of this? I think I should get... What did you need? You needed olive oil, right? We got 12. I think we're fine with that. <laughs> we never had a ditch that used olive oil before. We got a lot of salt as well. Although salt is always good to have. I'll just keep sending you salt. Keep sending you for salt. Four to five, you usually get way more. All right, you dispatch. Oh god, this is gonna take forever because they're gonna play this fucking... Why are you playing this animation as if you're like loading the dispatching as if they're like going to a new new zone that you have to load in my guy um we'll get some mayonnaise for you yes oh god i guess i should do them all at the same time you will get you both will get this there we go and then we we are fine could have more people Okay, menu. Here we go. So we have some crazy dishes. We got this one. Shouldn't we have another boss dish as well? Where's the other boss dish? Didn't I make it? I thought there were two. I thought I had two boss, boss ingredients. Don't I? What is my highest uh, rank? Yeah, here. We have this as well. How do I never... Why did I not get to use this? I mean, what... I need the Cleon Queen soup, but I have zero. Oh, I have zero of it. I have zero of this, but I have one of this goblin shark belly roast. And then we have this one, uh, which we both can't. Wait. How do I sell that? I guess I have to wait or do I have both of them? I'm confused. Sorry. Uh, your max level. And the other one just doesn't exist. Okay, so the, the goblin shark thing will probably pop up later. Uh, anyway, we're going to put this on here. So this is 10. 10, and we need this to sell. Because this is like the most expensive shit of all time. So we're going to put that on there. And then we need to kind of be careful about what else we put on here. We don't want to be wasting too many ingredients. So I think this one right here, I'm going to save. Also, we need to remember this recipe because this is our best rice recipe, I think. It also makes six per... So we have six times six, 36 dishes total for 500. That's crazy. Um, the vegetable sushi. We could throw the vegetable sushi on there because we need to make money of our vegetables. So I think that's like the only thing we can do with the vegetables anyway. Should enhance it though. Oh, oh wait, this is my favorite one. <laughs> I love this. I was about to skip it, but you got to see this one.
Oh no. <laughs> I need a screenshot of this guy's face. <laughs> it's too funny. Okay, there we go. Level two. I think we upgrade this again. This might be, wait a minute. This might be our, because we need to get a, a dish that has a 250 happiness rating. I think we might have to upgrade this twice. Twice more to get that, because it upgrades. No, it might have to be three times more. This thing, maybe? This is at 180 on level three. This is at 160 on level three. How the fuck are we going to get a dish that makes people that happy? That's impossible, brother. This is too expensive to upgrade for sure. I think I'll throw this on here. Throw that on there and auto supply. This is very expensive. But also it makes too much. I think it makes too much. We're just gonna throw some more uh, sushi on or like this type of sushi on there. This is also potentially, the, nah. Throw this on there because there's not too much, right? It's not too much and it's quite expensive. So even if we sell some of this, that's fine. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna throw, I'm gonna leave it at this. How much money is this gonna make? That alone is 6,000. I think if we sell all of the stuff that's on our menu right now, we'd be totally happy. So I don't wanna overflow. I know this is crazy, but bear with me for a moment here. Just, just, just roll with me here. I think this is a potentially good plan. If we can sell all of this, we are happy. So let's, I think I've been going quantity over quality. Let's, let's do some quality for once. Uh, let's try and sell all this and see if we can do that. Uh, no one's coming. Oh, there we go. <laughs> cool. We gotta be fast because we're the only one that can do this. I really need a, an employee that can do this shit. Oh God, there's no way I can do all these. Oh, I might be able to do this. Oh, the other one's going to be done. Oh, maybe I can be there in time. I can be there in time. I cannot be there in time. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Do they just leave or do they still order? No, they still order, but they're going to be mad and they're not going to give us a tip. We're making money. This is going okay. We need to pay attention to the menu and how much we sell here. Like if this was a good strategy or not. I need to be for the wasabi. Wasabi, wasabi, wasabi. Oh boy. Why are you guys not making more? There you go. This is looking good. Holy shit, wait, we're actually getting so much money. Oh, let's look, look at that, we sold everything. I think that was good. Like we could have obviously put some more on there. But I th no, we still had one left. We still had one left over. We 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 made a new record. Look at that shit. Oh, whoops. What did I just do? Perfect. We just absolutely destroyed yesterday's record. What the fuck? <laughs> that was totally distract. So quant quality over quantity is the way to go. <laughs> Look at that. Thirteen and a half thousand there. And that's our new bestseller. Nice. That just, that alone made 40. The, the boss dishes are so busted, man. Like the boss dishes alone make you so much money. But I like how they do that. I like how the boss dishes work, right? They're like, uh, don't just give you money for fighting the boss. No, they make you make it into sushi and then sell it. It's like, so you feel like you earned it doubly. You like earned it even more. That was good stuff though. We really got to continue the storyline though because we're kind of uh we forgot about the <laughs> about the sea people next day i've been having a lot of fun though just making money honestly oh udo wait can i have a moment with you oh you're a reporter from before do you need help with something thanks to your help my boss entrusted me with a new project i'm sure a promotion will be in order well anyway Tell me, sir, have you seen extremely novel fish inside this giant blue hole? And there are fish from many different locales here. What do you mean by novel? I mean very peculiar fish, the sort no one has ever discovered before. Our magazine has a secret weapon, the fish radar, and it tells us that this blue hole is a treasure trove. Isn't it trove? Treasure drove? I've never... I thought it was treasure trove. 
of undiscovered species. We, we, we weekly fish are planning a series of specials over the next few months to showcase these pr precious new fish. It's called the Catch Them All Project. We can research the fish on the weekdays, and if you can catch the specimens for us over the weekends, we'll be featured in the specials that we'll be publishing in the Weekly Fish every Monday. Yes, Monday. Me, catch them. But well, you are kind of the only diver in these parts, aren't you? I'm not really following your logic. In any case, as we have to have the issue ready by Monday, you'll have to catch the specimen by Sunday evening at the latest. That's tomorrow, isn't it? This, this is just too sudden. Now then... Let's get down to business. The fish we spotted with our radar this week was the humphead parrotfish. Oh, it's like, it's freaking like the catching fish in Terraria. <laughs> the humphead parrotfish? Hmm, a horned parrotfish. Never seen anything like it. The location is close to the boat wreck. That's what I can detect. Oh, and I'll give you the fish tracker. There's a fish mon you need to catch nearby. It'll vibrate and play a sound. Oh, and don't be surprised. Guess what this device can do? It allows you to see all the information about fish, even while diving in the water. You can see your best grade fish, how many fish you have in your restaurant, and fish farm, and more! Is that right? But how is that possible when I didn't link my device yet? Oh, you're a bit clueless, aren't you? By the way, good luck then. That's till Sunday, or tomorrow evening, to be precise. This is sudden. Work for a magazine? Come to think of it, I think I've seen the boat wreck in passing. Nice. Okay. Uh, strange creatures will appear sometimes in the giant blue hole. They're called Fishmon <laughs> and are anything but easy to catch. Get information from the journalist Udo who comes on Saturdays. Okay. Dude, more mechanics, more things to keep track of. From now on, you can use the fish tracker underwater with Hilda. Use this device. What a weird button. Uh, count the number of fish from the fish farm. And sushi restaurant and check the grade of fish you will catch while you are still in the water nice that's useful oh new product stock mm, some kind of mail is here should i check it oh it's going to be another festival isn't it uh this is the blue hole tourism committee i am sure you all know the story of an old man who couldn't catch a fish for 84 day days of the coast of the gulf of mexico the fish he finally caught was a marlin and now marlins are beginning to be sighted in the waters near the blue hole the season's opportunity the committee decided to host a marlin party three days from now. Local restaurant owners are encouraged to participate in this event to rack up revenue. Rumor has it that some even cited sailfish not very often, though. Okay. What the fuck? Okay, I need to... The VIP is already tomorrow, by the way? Uh-oh. I need this. Dude, I have so much fucking money. I need to check the... F the... How's the VIP already tomorrow? This is a disaster. We need to take care of the farm. We need wheat, man. We have- we're gonna have eggs, right? We have so many chickens. You can raise up to five chickens per breed. Okay. What do you think? Neat, right? We got a grade A- one grade A- oh, and the other ones laid normal eggs. That's good, though, but we got one grade A egg. Uh, that feels like I got a bit unlucky there, because they all got a 70% chance and we only got one. That seems a bit ridiculous. Uh, anyway, look at the nutrients. They're up to max. Nice. I need, really need wheat. So I gotta, I gotta buy some fertilizer every now and then to put the nutrients back on. Max. Okay, wheat. Let's just get six wheat. I don't care. Um... Stupid the fucking rapper guy. <laughs> Ridiculous. Uh, can I get my... There. Oh, boy. I can't get another... I think I should max out the chickens. I think we should get another of the maximum upgraded chicken. I think that's a good way to spend our money. Let's just get it. Here we go. We got a chicken. We have three chickens to name if you guys want. <laughs> I don't know what they should be called. I have no idea. I'm out of name ideas. Uh, and then we could... Oh my god, that's so expensive. That is so expensive. We should maybe do growth fertilizer. That accelerates plants growth. How long does this take to grow? I think I might need to. I don't think I can get this in time. Uh... Wait, is this just for one? What? Can I not use this? Oh, you can only use one at the same time? I thought. Oh, no. 
No. Okay. Well, I might not have the sushi in time then. This is going to be the first time I'm going to fail, fail a VIP because I didn't have any wheat. Totally my fault, by the way. Because I, I mean, not really, because I didn't know I was going to need wheat. But uh, if I knew, I could have had it beforehand. Uh, that could be a problem. I think there's like nothing I can do though. So rip. <laughs> like, what, what do you want from me? It's fine. We'll just like, I find it. This is a ridiculous one. Like up till now, they made somewhat sense, but a fucking random, random people coming to you with asking you to make Chinese cuisine, which were obviously just a sushi restaurant. Like, fuck off. <laughs> Don't bother me with your garbage. Okay. Let's upgrade the... Hmm, I think I want this. Let's upgrade this thing. We can use it twice. Yes. And then I think I'm upgrading my oxygen again because that has actually been kind of a problem. And then we're pretty good. Okay, let's go to the sea people because we got stuff to do. We want to... Hmm, but I... You know what? No. We're going... Yeah, we have everything we need except the wheat. Oh, but I can buy the wheat! Someone was screaming this at the screen, and I heard you through the screen. Thank you. Thank you, whoever you are, who was screaming that I can buy the wheat. <laughs> I heard you from the future. <laughs> Wait a minute. Right? Yeah, there you go. Nice. I'm just buying three. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, saved. Saved. <laughs> Nice. Okay. We, we did that. That was teamwork. <laughs> okay. Now we got to do... I think I'm just going to go in the natural way and then, like, go through until the... Because I want to go to the sea people to um, go down to the glacier. But I also want to get the horned parrotfish, man. Because that capture... Let's go to there. Because we also need to go cobra... Oh, no. We need to get there anyway because we need to get cobra's lost crowbar. To get, continue the Sea People quest. I was just completely distracted all episode last time doing other stuff. <laughs> That's fine. It happens. Especially to me. That thing looks terrifying, by the way. Anything with, like, spikes in the deep sea, you know it's gonna have, like, the most... the most insane poison the world has ever seen. So I can use this now. Oh. Holy shit, we got 45 of this. Got 59 of this, 113 of this. One might say I have too much. Red-lipped batfish? Oh, this is just what we've seen. We don't have the meat. Okay. 300, by the way, look at that. <laughs> That's a lot of stuff. Oh no, I fucking hate- Dude, they genuinely do 100 damage at, at the time. It's fucking absolutely insane. Go oh, fuck yourself. Jesus Christ. Like, what are you supposed to do against those guys, man? I mean, I guess just run and scream. I feel a little stupid. I will definitely need this right now. So, the wreck. Can I find the wreck? Usually it's... Down around here. Do I need these guys? I don't think I do. Also, you guys are from one of the special dishes that I can unlock. So what are you? I'm getting many fish. Don't get killed by the jelly. New fish. Um, I will get two jelly. I don't want two jellies. No, what am I kidding? What am I kidding? Um, you just go away, sir. You, I want you. Oh, no, I missed. Okay, get the bullets. Please. And then I get you. Because you're going to be expensive. Oh, tiger fish. I never... You, you're lucky that I got, like, infinite tiger fish meat. I never need to catch you ever again. I don't know if I'm going too deep. What are these, by the way? What? Are those sailfish? Can they even be slept? They can be slept. They're Spanish mackerels. Okay. 
These are also good for like one of my most expensive dishes out there. Yeah, the Harlequin and does that also need the that also need the Titan Titan fish, right? So I, I literally never need to Oh nice, we get bullets back. That was literally was what I was hoping for. I don't need you. And we got a good thing going here. <laughs> There's a wreck. Not the wreck though. These guys. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. And then these guys. Yes. These are all the fish we need. Okay. You just go to bed. Go to bread. I don't need you. There's so many to Dude, this is heaven. I like that they... I don't know. It feels like I can pretty easily identify specific fish I want. There's obviously a lot more. But you can't just focus on a few fish at the time to make stuff more manageable because it's kind of crazy how many fish there are. <laughs> but luckily, some are very easy to spot. And, there. and then we can start farming these and get more and more cash. And then we get big stoinks. Get the ammo too. Dude, this is crazy. And we only got 50? These guys are so light too. This is fish heaven. I mean, not for them, for me. <laughs> oh my god, look at that guy's a hammer shark! Whoa! <laughs> That's awesome. Look at that guy. Oh no! Oh, he's gonna do so much damage, isn't he? He's gonna like one shot me. Uh, for thumbnail purposes, I gotta be over here for a second. Because I want to try and get a good screenshot of this guy. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm gonna die for the screenshot. Title of the video, I died for this thumbnail. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, he's fighting other fish. Help. Oh, my God. Dude, he's epic. Oh, God, he's scary, though. Come over here. I need, I need more oxygen. Who am I? Who, I should be careful, man. Don't be stupid. That's not oxygen. It's a fucking golf club. Okay, we're coming back there in a sec. There's another one. There's the wreck! Nice. We reached our destination. You have reached your destination. Did this megalodon please bugger off? That's what the British say, right? Crazy how much I can carry at the time. And you should be here too. Where's the other fish? Right, I'm just gonna grab this. Could go in there. Oh god, this guy. <laughs> he is a big boy. I'm gonna get you guys still. focus on a few fish i think this is the secret just focus on a few fish you because then you can also make use of like having upgraded the recipe right because i got these recipes upgraded quite a lot so they are you, you gotta specialize specialize in, and oh we got a hundred already though fuck i may be carrying a little too much i really want to kill this hammer shark though I mean, I don't know if I can kill it. It seems kind of a lost cause. Oh no, there he is. And you are awesome. Ah! Oh my god! Help! Oh no, he's gonna attack. Run! Oh boy. That's crazy. Did you just hit a wall? Oh my god, he does so much damage. He does so much damage. He fucking hit me once and he almost one shot me. It's insane, dude. I need to get oxygen. Thank you. Yes, instead of this, I don't care. Use it immediately. Okay, good stuff. Now we can continue. Gotta be careful. 
Hi, sir. Yeah, sneak up behind him. Got a dodge. He's pretty slow. Like, he just has very strong attacks. We gotta wait for his, like, mega hammer smash. Oh, no, he, he like, has a huge... One. Oh, no. Gotta do his dash. And then he does a swingy swing. Let me get this. Do your thing. Do your smash. Hammer shark. Why are hammer... Are hammer shark literally this shape? I mean, the shape must be... Like, are they actually smashing things with their head? Is that how they fight? <laughs> that is so funny. Oh, I got inks, but that's fine. Come on, die. Let's go! And then we can Q him as well, because we still got two Qs. Nice. Let's go, dude. <laughs> Mega shark. Damn. I mean, it's not going to be three star, but still. New smooth hammerhead. You're a smooth hammerhead. How does it feel? What is a rough hammerhead then? Or is that not a fish? I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, any ammo over here? Oh, thank you. We need to go back to the... Because we are almost full and we need to get the other fish. It's What's so nice about doing the... Oh, man. I'm... I'm I want these, though. What's so nice about the... Um, the lift machine is also that it doesn't take your inventory space, so you can, like, get great fish without costing any of your inventory. Okay, these are six kilos per piece. I could get you guys, but I'd rather get someone else with the Q thingy. I'd rather just do the one, like, the big fish around the ship. Wasn't the shipwreck over here? Or am I going too deep now? There's that. Leave here. Also, you guys. Hello. That's a golf club, I guess. Sure. Okay. Where's this guy? We're around the sea wreck. Oh, we're at the wreck, but there's this guy. I don't want to deal with you. I'm assuming it's going to be down here, maybe? Nope. Nope. Not at all. That's very good. Oh god, that's not very good. Luckily, you pro you aren't even that strong compared to like a hammerhead. Give me this. Push. Oh, I could kill you, but it's kind of pointless. And then, do we go in here? Do we have to go in here? Let's see it. Maybe the crowbar is in this area. And the other fish as well. Because we... Oh, let's see. And these guys are in here too. Oh yeah, you have to go in here. I see. I'm stupid. There's a big shark. Another hammerhead. Holy shit. Get ready. Oh. I really needed a better harpoon here. Guess I got shit harpoon. Am I gonna reach? Nope. Even when he swims into it, doesn't do anything. Oh no. Hey, gotta juke him. This is actually easy. Maybe this is not a very special. I just fucking did a golf smash. Oh, he's done himself. What an idiot. Dude, these guys are these guys are so easy to dodge. I'm gonna get both of them. I'm gonna get this one too. <laughs> Maybe I should have saved it for the special fish. Uh, actually, now that I think about it, I probably should have saved it for the special fish, but it's fine. Maybe we won't even find that one tonight. 13 kilos, and I didn't even take up a single space. 
Oh, look at that guy. No, I should have saved it for you. Dude. Ow. Holy shit, he's fast. Oh, no, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I need to leave. I need to leave. I need to leave. But you know what? I can do... I can kill you with this thing. I don't want you. And then maybe I can... You are kind of small. Probably too big for this. But I have to try. Look right on the tip of his nose. Yeah, he's too big. Uh, but maybe this. Oh, shit. <gasps> no, but I can't. But I can kill you. Oh, man. I regret my words and my deeds. But at least this works. You fuck off, sir. I don't want you. I'm literally just murdering this guy while he can't even escape. It's so fucked up. Man, he was tanky, though. Holy shit. Can he even be killed? There we go. Okay. You need to sleep while I get the other guy. We're not going to be able to carry this, are we? Nine kilos. Oh, okay. I am full. Fuck off. Uh, I should check for a crowbar and I should throw some other stuff away because I am too full. Let's see. Um, I don't need this. Discard. Then we need... Don't need you. Don't need you, but you guys are not very heavy, so this is not really getting me anywhere. Uh, you guys... Is all super light. These are six. Maybe I should ditch some of these. There. Now we have enough. I want to make sure I'm fast. And then let's see. Where's your crowbar, sir? Down here somewhere? Or did I just come from the. Oh, there we go. There it is. Oh, there it is, Koba's crowbar. But it's buried under the rocks. I need to remove the rocks. Easy peasy. Grab it. Are you just kidding me? It's still buried in your book? Not in my book, but okay. Um, What is happening here? Grab this real quick before I bury it and... Oh, I need to bring them over here. This area is highlighted. I see. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, hi there. Wait, you guys. You guys are from the tooltips. Boing, 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 boing. Looks like I aggravated a colony of crabs. They look ferocious. I need to deal with them to pick up the crowbar. How about we... Dude, you fucking ju juked me. Are you kidding me? They can't be killed. They can't be killed with this, though. I'm sorry, but I gotta crack you like I'm a bird. Whoops. Wait, they all died? Wait, the, the other guy killed himself? How did you kill yourself? What happened, dude? <laughs> I didn't even touch him. Wee. Oh, God. Nice. Let's go. Okay. Why does it look familiar? Is it my crowbar? Did he steal my crowbar at one point? Now, where the hell is the other fish, though? The big fish? Because we need you as well. Maybe he's down here? I would assume he's not. Can you just kill... I don't want to capture you. It still only does, like, one damage, doesn't it? If you are go into fish mode like this. Yeah, it only does one damage if you can catch them, just so you don't kill them. But I want to kill them. He's bleeding, though. Hmm. I don't see anything else here. Yeah, I don't think... I mean, there's that thing, but I don't want that even. But I'm out of here. I could get you guys, though. I think we're actually... Like, the white Trevally, I got way more... Oh, my God, I'm so bad. I got way more... Okay, you need to fucking die. You know, this is so stupid. I gotta kill you 
Put you in my inventory so I can then fucking shred you in the paper shredder. Like my my guy. Sometimes I don't want to deal with you guys. You suck. <laughs> okay, so now I gotta go into my inventory and throw out which you can't sort this by the way, for some reason. You can't sort your inventory. Uh and then throw that's selfish. Wait, it's it is sorted somewhat. Okay, where's the barracuda? Is it at the top? Great barracuda. Get the shit out of here. And then we'll... This is new fish, but they're so heavy. I think I think we'll keep them, though. And then we'll ditch the white trevallis instead, because, like, to be fair, we got, like, millions of them. There. Now we're faster. Need to get out of there and look for the fish. Although... You know what? No, let's leave now because then we have another queue where we can pick them up for like in to get like a special dish with the with that fish. Because I don't want to just like get the, the bad meat. I mean, I guess I'm going to get the bad meat regardless because I'm going to kill it. Why did that? Why are they making me kill it? What what happened to taking photos? Oh, God, everyone just spawned in. Did it say that I was near it? I mean, it's near the shipwreck. You said I'm right near the shipwreck. I don't know what you want from me. There's that guy. I think we just leave this one. We just leave this one. Because we got a full inventory. And we got stuff to do. I want to do another fishing trip. Give it to me. I, I'm also, like, I, I've said this before, but my rich... Why is the loading screen so long? What the fuck? Uh, oh, that's the one I ordered. Ha ha ha. So you take this to the rock, insert it between the cracks, and pull hard like this. Then you will be able to take it out of the rock. Ha ha. Nice. I will be able to move the mirror with this. That's good. Since you're here, why don't you check your gear? Don't forget to stop by Bonsho Sushi. We'd have to stop by Bonsho Sushi right now. Deep in the glacial passage. You got this stuff. Look at all that. <laughs> oh, baby. I should quickly... I need to always... The cops, crops are grown already? It's one day harvest? What the fuck? <laughs> but as I was saying, uh, I the way I've been doing Dave the Diver is like every... Four days or something. I uh, I uh, spend like four hours playing this game, just having fun, and then I order sushi because <laughs> it feels very fitting. Okay, they didn't give me much though. We gotta put more stuff on it. I guess I'm gonna put some garlic on there just in case they're gonna. I'll put some garlic and some some of this on there. Because we already got enough vegetable sushi. Although the vegetable sushi is crazy expensive. I think this is already... Yeah, I already put stuff on there. Oh, wait. I can put this on there now. Yeah, maybe it works. Or probably not. Maybe, though. Let's see. So it's growing faster now. For the rice, I think that's even more valuable. Let's do it for the rice. Growth fertilizer. Because the rice is like makes some of the craziest dishes. Okay. I should check on Bonsho Sushi, he said. I don't know why, but we'll do it real quick. There's something in here, or are you just. Uh... Oh, did we have to talk to Bonsho? Oh, yeah, we had to talk to Bonsho about something, didn't we? Uh, cuisine made with seaweed. A simple dish using seaweed will not leave a strong impression. They probably have that at the Sea People Village. First, bring me seaweed, white rice, and sea urchin. I'll give them a harmonious blend of ingredients. Mm. I have all of this. I, I literally have all, You brought me the ingredients. Then I'll start preparing sea urchin seaweed rice. Cutscene time. Mm. Nice. 
Yeah, the sea people should be satisfied with this. Thank you, Boncho. Bring it to the sea people farmer. And I need to feed the family here. Meow, meow. Oh, he's so, he's so funny. He's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. Look at that dude. Oh my God, look at that dude. <laughs> oh gee, feed it. Yes. That's adorable. What the fuck? <laughs> You're breaking my heart out here. Okay, let's go uh, fishing. We need to go to Sea People Village now because we can continue the quest. So we got to do that because we're otherwise never going to beat this game, which is fine in my book. I've been having a lot of fun. <laughs> can keep going forever. The loading streets are getting longer or am I crazy? Um, okay, Sea People. Yes, it's afternoon. The VIP will be tomorrow. That's fine. We still need to, we need wait what day is it we need to get that parrot fish what i i don't know what day it is i hope it's not it's saturday right saturday so we have sunday still but tomorrow we have to catch it otherwise we're gonna miss out um is this gonna be a problem also, I want to get the farm over here going because remember, we're going to get another farm on top of our farm on top of our farm. We got a fish farm, three different farm, regular farms, and then <laughs> we are going to get a seaweed farm now, too. Here you go. Here, this is cuisine made from seaweed. What are these little round white balls? Human cuisine. I can predict the taste, but I'll give it a try. It's going to go like, whoa. What the fuck? Ah, <laughs> oh, this is a new taste. The soft texture of seaweed and the little white grains, they go so well together. This yellow thing, it adds such flavor. They're sea urchin eggs. Is this your first time seeing them? Sea urchin, the spiky creature humans eat that kind of stuff? I guess humans are able to use various sea ingredients. I'm surprised. Uh-huh, Bancho was very serious about seafood. All right, a promise is a promise. I'll open up the seaweed farm for you. Oh, however, I have to make a separate farm tr to avoid food supply issues to the village. It's going to take some time. Please wait, and I'll be back later. This is exciting. Okay, let's go. We're going to get another farm. Uh, now, what do we need to do? We just got to move the mirror. Hi, friends. I want to play ball with you guys. Because we need to do the story mission. Which there's also a fish down there, by the way. And this guy's always just chilling out here. What are you doing? My choice is to protect the village from all threats. Go find a way into the glacial area. Always so commanding. He better get, like, crushed by an icicle or something. <laughs> and we need to get more of these guys as well. Because we got the festival. Dude, there's always, always so much going on. Like... How do you ever t ever take a break of this game? Like, you're always just moving. I mean, I have to take a break because I got shit to do, but I guess that's the way it goes. You got shit to do. Uh, I somehow missed both of them like an absolute buffoon. I want these. You can expand the fish farm for these guys. Don't wake up yet. So many bullets here. Oh no, this guy is definitely going to be waking up. Hey, sleepy boy. Nice. Uh, excuse me, you juked me. That's not allowed. Not on my watch. You're coming with me. There will I. Okay, let's check down here. So now we can do this. Yes. Well, I should be able to pick out that rock using the crowbar. Also, hi there. Are you new? I don't remember you. you make poison? Vampire squid. I do remember you guys. The name. Oh. Nice. Thank you for putting fish down here, by the way. I really appreciate it. So I don't have to go out and do a normal fishing day today. Okay. Uh, we do... 
Crowbar up top. Oh, the rock is, is stuck. Couldn't I have just picked up the rock? Oh, yeah, there you go. Oh, I do it with the... I see. I'm oh, sure. Oh, and then it falls. We're melting the ice. This does not seem like the solution to your problem. I mean, maybe it is. The divine tree fruit has unbelievable energy. It just melt the thick ice wall. Well, let me go down again. It's cold, by the way. I could kill for a hot bowl of miso soup from Bancho Sushi. I could go for some miso soup. Can I, like, die by the laser? Shouldn't the laser be really hot? Oh god, what are you? Oh, look at that boy! What the fuck? Dude, this is a dead end too. I am almost there. I should check the surroundings first. Yes, I know. New fish? Pelican eel. I love how they just put all these fish in one room for me to go to town. What is this guy? Is this new too? Elmo octop. No, that's not what that was. Blob! It's a blobfish! We got a blobfish! <laughs> Let's go. It's cold here and the lens is coll has collected frost. I need to clean the lens first. What the fuck? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> this is weird. <laughs> it's just making me uncomfortable. It's kind of strangely satisfying, though. His hands just in front of the lens. Hi. Hi, everyone. Did I get it? Wipe up the mural in the glacier. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. The mural in the glacier passage five. What are you talking about? Do I got to zoom out? Oh, there. Oh no, come on! Fuck. Stupid frost. You go too fast, it like bugs out. Makes bubbles. Okay, wait. Go. Oh. What? Is this not it? What do you want? Wiping off frost? Didn't I do that? Where's the frost? Where's the frost? I don't see... Oh, there we go. I don't know where it was. There was like one tiny little bit left. Nice. Okay. Um, what do we got around here? There's a passage. We can go this way. You said it was a dead end. Oh, because we need to go deeper. We got to go deeper. Making me want to play Subnautica again. And get killed by giant Levi ghost leviathans. is this oh no puzzle time i'm stupid at puzzles the ice wall is blocking the way i think i can meld it using the divine tree fruit device excuse oh i need a divine tree fruit though which is over here luckily these guys are just laying around everywhere he's like super rare i don't even know how i'm touching this shouldn't this be super hot like a nuclear bomb. Okay, now I gotta rotate. That is not the right way to rotate. Do we wanna go up? Where are we shining this? Is this even what we're supposed to do? Does this go through here or what? I, I assume not. We just need to do something in that area. Loading screen, please. You're making my life miserable. What are you even loading? It's the tiniest room of my life. Okay, well, there was nothing here, so we go back. <laughs> hey, it's fine. It's fine. The, game, the game's got, got to take some rest, too, sometimes. Um, I'm not seeing anything. Okay, there we go. Uh, rotate EU. I guess we go down here. Oh, because we're trying to... Oh, I need to open up. Wait a minute. Rotate again. This is not. 
Oh, we need to melt this. Yes, melt this. Why do you rotate in this stupid way? Melt this so I can click the button. Back. And then we can open that. And this is just for bonus money, though. But that's fine. I don't want some bonus cash. I think this thing sold for like 300 or something, I remember. Gonna get rich. Just selling... Selling the ancient artifacts of the sea people seems a bit unethical, but hey, capitalism. And then they're gonna be like, you made it even worse. You melted all the ice, you idiot. You killed us all, you ruined us. What am I supposed to do down here? More fish. I already got 75 worth of fish. Uh, there's a mural here as well. I should take a picture and show it to Dr. Bacon. I want a blobfish. Look at that. They're just totally normal fish. They just look insane because if you take them out of their high pressure environment, they like literally implode. It's like as if you would take a human to space and then you would fucking explode and be like a bloody pulp and then they would look at you like haha look at this guy he's a fucking bloody mess that's because you sent me to space idiot that's not where i'm supposed to be i don't know what a human would look like when they go to space though they'd probably just explode but then part of it would be intact i don't know oh god we gotta wipe again god damn it gotta gotta be very thorough, because even a tiny bit can ruin this, apparently. There we go. And then I need to zoom. Just stir. <clears throat> Better get a lot of money for this. I mean, I don't think I'm even going to get paid for this at all. I already got a hundred kilos. It's, it's interesting how the tiny fish here are way heavier than at the surface. I guess they gotta be. I don't know how. I don't know how pressure works. Okay. Hmm, the mirrors here are not well aligned. Is there a way to align them? We can pull them. Yeah. Thank you for giving me that like classic, <laughs> classic video game explanation. Uh. Oh, shit. I messed up. I gotta do you like this. It's gonna work first try. I'm not even... I don't even need the laser. I mean, obviously. And then you go over here. This type of stuff reminds me of Ori in the Blind Forest for some reason. That game is so good. You've never played them. Highly recommend. I mean, they're a very different genre. And I hate platformers. So <laughs> the fact that I like Ori and the Blind Forest, which is basically a platformer, is should be... I mean, should that be a good sign? I would say it is a good sign. I like it because of the atmosphere, the environments, the music is incredible. Storytelling is like very little text, very little or very... Many, many vibes. And we are 400 meters deep, by the way. 500 is... 540 is apparently the max. Oh, the laser keeps going. Oh. Is there going to be a secret down here if I keep rotating it? Maybe. I don't really care, though. Uh, okay, how is this going to go? Where do I need to bring this i need to bring this laser Ooh, i'll pick this we gotta go i can't rotate these guys right this one goes down so this one can go up so this one is like this catching the laser this one is like this 
and then this one just rotates. Easy. Go faster. Boom. Look at the. <laughs> nice. Next area. Good. The actual block in the exit has mel molten away. Now, if I go past it, I will find a door to the glacial area. Phew, this place is really cold. I could use a hot cup of green tea right now. You're always could use some. Oh, I haven't seen you eat a single time. I think maybe at the start you ate some stuff, but you gotta give yourself some good sushi every now and then. You deserve it. I mean, if there's anyone working their ass off, it's definitely Dave. This place is too dark. I can't see anything. Right, I hit this fruit and it glowed. I should use this. Oh god, we're gonna see some terrifying creatures when we hit this. Surrounded by monsters. Hit it. Oh, uh, hi there. What the fuck are you? Is that King King Long or whatever the hell? Uh oh. Oh my god. Look at that guy. <laughs> He's awesome. Uh, do I do something? Ah, uh, what is this thing? Like, that Gadon is humongous. It's almost unreal. Oh, it's thankfully chained. Let me escape this place riding the current. Holy shit. <laughs> well then, that's uh, pretty cool. As I said, you are always surprised by what this game has to offer. You never know what's around the corner. I think I should maybe restart the game every now and then. I think there might be a memory leak. Because the loading screens are getting, like, exponentially longer. Phew! That thing shouldn't be able to escape. Shouldn't be able to escape since it's so big. Now I just have to get out with this current. Uh oh, maybe you can, though. <laughs> oh, giant Gadon. Uh-oh. No, no way! We're going to die if we get caught. Let's run away. Are you talking to me? We? I mean, I guess I say we all the time. Oh no. Oh boy. Stay in the middle so you can dodge. Um, I'm trying to go as fast as possible. I might. Oh. Ah, my face! Like this? Yes. Wait, how'd he get me? Excuse me. How did he, I I thought he was going up, so I went down. But I guess I had to go up when he goes up. That doesn't really make any sense, but okay. Or maybe I gotta go further away. I thought I was dodging him like I how I should. Okay, anyway. I just go fucking Eden. That's the alternative universe. Okay, so I go up now, right? Yeah. Okay, so there I go up. I see. And he does this. I go up again. That's easy. Don't do the up move. The up move is undodgeable. Or maybe I got it. Oh, what's he doing? Stay down so he does or use the attack down here, maybe. Oh boy. And this place is a lot bigger than it looks, huh? No! My face! Oh, come on. I want to stay down. Uh oh. Something doesn't seem right. I think it's preparing an attack. What do I do? Wait, is that the vine tree fruit? It hates light, so if we hit that. Let's go. Go! Oh. Boing! get a head start keep going this is awesome <laughs> i like how the bosses are different they're not all oh god that's bad uh it's a dead end there's no way out my goodness maybe we can bait him to break it idiot uh he killed himself what a dummy that was a close call i think it fainted 
path opened up after we hit it earlier. Let's run away before it awakes. It's definitely gonna keep going. Uh, we're going very deep. Excuse me. Our our diving suit is gonna explode. Uh oh. It's awake already. What a disgusting creature. Let's run away. Um, the depth is question mark question mark question mark. By the way, if you were interested. <laughs> It doesn't actually count the depth there. That would be, uh... Oh, no. oh boy. This is, uh, very tricky. Oh. Oh! I'm barely dodging. Oh, my God. The fucking fucked up Flappy Bird over here. Let's go. Oh no. <laughs> Idiot. Oh. Did I lose the creature? What is that vibration? It's coming. Run. And this guy is very fast. <laughs> Once again, what a dummy. I shouldn't let my guard down. The current is flowing back to the right. There should be a way out nearby. Let's run before it awakes. We are so far away from anywhere. These are big things. I'm going to be stopped by those. Time and space is convoluted. He's definitely coming back. Or maybe this is just literal Flappy Bird. <laughs> Who would have thought? Oh god! Who would have thought that this game would turn into Flappy Bird? Not me. I mean, that, this is the same thing I said when the game turned into a rhythm game. Oh, there's light. I'll be as be able to escape that way. At this point, it could turn into anything. Ah, uh, cute. Eek. Let's go. I love this fucking quick time event. Nice. That was fun though. That was cool. We're definitely gonna have to fight that guy later. Very aggressive. I don't know why he wanted to eat me so bad. I guess he haven't hasn't eaten something in a while. And we're somehow back here. Are you kidding? Me? I managed to escape. I must barricade the entrance before the Godon comes after me. Yes, do it. Come on. Are we have to do some kind of mini game. Yeah, there you go. This is not gonna stop him. Excuse me? What? Is that Suwam helping finally for the first time? He's dead. Get wrecked. No. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Uh, just let me die. I'd rather die than be saved by saved by this fucking asshole. To um, humans are not that trustworthy. You would have already been eaten by the deep sea fish. Were I not there for you, I admit it this time. Thank you. Well, go and find out what's happening in the glacial area, as you promised me, human. I didn't imagine this place would be this cold. I will freeze to death if I go down further. Oh, you helpless human, you do not have any gear for, or clothes to protect your body from the cold then? Well, I must first return to Cobra and ask him. He may have something to protect me from the cold. But well, we have no other options then. Let's return to the village. You see that huge mirror in the back? Let's activate it and you will be whisked away to the village. You pull that lever, I will pull the left one. Okay. He's gonna be grabbed. What are you doing? Grab the lever. He's actually finally... Are th is this how they're gonna redeem this asshole? By making him actually useful? That doesn't feel like the right way. He needs to get his comeuppance. Alright, we pull these levers at once on my signal, okay? Good. Now we can access this place straight from the village. Go back to the village and find a way to withstand the cold humans. Humans are so fragile. This is something unthinkable for a superior warrior like me, Suwam. Your tail has been shaken for some time now. Are you all right? 
What are you talking about? You're clearly mistaken, human. Let's return to the village for now. Achoo! Uh, I guess Krill went up my nose. What? Disgusting. He's, he's sick? Is he gonna die? Are we gonna help him out now? What's going on here? How is this gonna change? They're obviously planning something with Suwam here. That guy... Uh, I can't believe he got off his own ass without being told to do so. That's kind of impressive. Oh, you came. How was the glacial area? Hmm, there was a huge godon in the passage, so the glacial area is too cold. And the glacial area is too cold for me to explore. I need something. You're ill-equipped to explore the area for sure with your light diving suit. Our people wear clothes with divine tree fruits and can withstand the cold. I'm curious, can your people tailor the divine tree fruit cloth cloths? Tailoring? Cobra or Dr. Bacon may know. You seem to have talented friends. Take this cloth and ask your friends. Hmm. Divine tree fruit cloths. I need to tailor it into a suit. It may protect me from the cold. And we get money. Look at that. All right, we're going straight out of here. We have already done everything. And I also really need to get my sushi. It's uh like 30 minutes from now. I got a stream and I, <laughs> I need to eat first. <laughs> So, if I was late on this day, and now you know why, because I was playing fucking Dave the Diver. <laughs> I mean, I'm always late, so it's not nothing new. No one's gonna know. It was our secret. Get the hell out of here, though. I know there's quests and stuff. I don't care. I have I have to go. Oh, Bo, please. Bye-bye. I could have probably done that quest real fast, but anyway. It's fine. We're coming back here anyway. And now they're gonna have like 17 million phone calls happening. <laughs> so we're gonna be here for like another hour. <laughs> Please, let me save the game. We got Pelican Eel. Nice. Thumbs up. And now everyone's gonna call me. Wrap up your day and get... Are you actually gonna let me do that though? We got bonus. Look at plus three, plus three. Holy shit. Nice. I'm gonna just redispatch all of them. It's amazing. Wait, I can save. Let's go. All right. Well, there's obviously stuff that we're going to be doing here, but I really got to go right now. Uh, life calls. So I will be seeing you all in the next episode. What a crazy episode this was. We had two insane nights, right? That was this. Yeah, we had the tuna night and we had the night after that. Breaking records left and right. We're making a lot of money. We got a lot of chickens. Again, we have three chickens to name if you want to do that. Otherwise, we'll just leave them have this basic name. Anyway, thank you so much for watching over on YouTube. I hope you, well, you're only on YouTube. This is not on Twitch. Anyway, my <laughs> I gotta go. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye bye. <laughs>